Yo, Megan Rapinoe? That's that, uh, we were talking about soccer. That's that female soccer player. Mm -hmm. I didn't catch this. She blamed Dave Chappelle, Martina Navratilova, Sage Steele for violence against trans people in an unhinged attack. Did you listen to it? I didn't see it. I didn't see this. Is it on video? Oh, let's pull the video. There's a video out there? You're taking a real woman's place. That's the part of the argument that's still extremely transphobic. I see trans women as real women. This is now this is nasty work. This is nasty work on your way out of the sport. As you escort your way out. Because it wouldn't have been no rapping, though, once you let the T people in. Ain't going to be no women in that shit. It's going to be the trans league. It's going to be men's league and trans league. That's what it's going to be. <laughs> Let's be real. So we're going to have two men's leagues. <laughs> Hotep, you're a genius. Hotepjesus.com. White women. I'm telling you. This is what we was talking about before. White women. White women are the ones enabling this shit. It's white women. HR. Oh, some white women. I mean, come on, man. Like Megan Rapinoe is a white woman. Yeah, but that the only reason they're weaponized is because the, the the machine is behind her. Because there's plenty of TERFs. Who's the TERFs? The ter no, TERFs are the white women. Yes. Hmm? Yes. This, this is white, white on white crime. It is. It is. But the media is behind, you know, the one in. But they're not going to bring up, you know, what's her name? Um, the, the girl who wrote all them books. You know what I mean? There's There's... And the athletes, you can't even say nothing. There was that one swimmer, but she had to stop, wait till she's off the team to say something. You say something, you're off the team. See, they were saying all crazy shit when that when that one swimmer was in there. The, the coach told the girls, "You got to deal with it. Deal with it." Mm. So nobody's gonna speak out. Niggas are pretty, you know, if you speak out, you get you getting cut. Like I'm sure there's girls in the WNBA like, no, nah, they ain't right. But they ain't gonna say nothing. There's nothing you can do about it. The DEI, whatever his name is. Dick eat, Dick Eaton in, in, in introduction, whatever the hell what does it stand for? <laughs> Diversity exclusionary in what is it? Diversity <laughs> Equity inclusion. <laughs> yeah. Came up with that, man. A white Was woman. A white, person? a white woman did that? A white woman came up with that. You sure? We need names. Man, stop, uh, I'm, stop blaming the Pauls for everything, man. Can we get a name? It's going to be all T people. I mean, the, it, the main issue is. If you do say something, you're out of a job. You're pretty much out of a job. If if one of those black girls who play basketball in the WNBA stands up and, and or or just doesn't even stand up, just happens to be in an interview and somebody says, "Hey, what do you think about that?" and they go, "I don't think that's a good idea. I think that's a little bit whatever, whatever." She's gonna be canceled. She won't be playing basketball no more. Not in the USA.